Oh, ouch. Ouch, what the heck? What the heck? Oh! Hey guys, this is Jason, and welcome back to another episode of Explore. Here we are in our world here, and hold on while I turn down my volume, because it's way too loud. Okay, we're back, and we're in our world, and um, we got our guard here. He's back to 99 health. Um, I guess he just recharged slowly or something, or maybe, maybe not, I don't know. Uh, but he's here. And he's back, and I guess we gotta find a name for him, because I literally just remembered we're gonna need a name for him. Let's name him Sir Edward. Uh, <laughs> Sir Edward, how about, uh, Lancelot? No, no, not that. Um, Sir Edward Longlance. That sounds fun. Come on, Edward Longlance, Mr. Sir Edward, Ed. Come on, Ed. We'll call him Ed for short. That sounds fun. Alright, um, thanks guys for your suggestions, by the way, on the last video in the comments for, like, names for this guy and stuff. It helped me out a lot. I think I saw someone say Sir Edward, um, and then I saw, like, Lance a lot, and, you know, a combination of all these things, because those are great night names, and you guys have good ideas. So, I think I guess kind of, I kind of combined a few, probably, but I guess we'll call him Sir Edward Lance a lot. Um, alright, um, we'll turn follow on. Oh, actually, off. We'll keep him off for now. You stay right here, Sir Ed. Um, we're gonna go ahead and show you guys what's new, and I think you may have already seen something that's new. Um, we made these this doorway a little more spacious, made this kind of look a little cool. Um, and, oh my god, you just saw something that I have changed drastically. Um, and that is the Tinker's Construct. We've actually added a Tinker's Construct. If we go through here, we will see a nice uh, wooden button. You go through and bam. We got our own little Tinker's Construct area. What's up, guard guy? How you doing? Um, or Ed. I gotta get used to it. Alright, Ed. You can't just be teleporting to me all the time. You're gonna have to stay off. Follow. That means you don't teleport. Alright, so um, we got our Tinker's Construct here. It's pretty much set up, but... Uh, if you notice, bam, yeah, that seared tank says empty, and that's because we don't have any lava. So, oh, excuse me, sorry. <laughs> We're gonna have to go to, uh, the cave across over there and grab some more metals and all that stuff from the metallurgy, metal, metallurgy mod or whatever, however you want to say it. What was that? Creeper? Creeper? Um... Yeah, but we're gonna go get some metals, and they actually work here with Tinker's Construct, so I can't wait to just get some lava, fill it up, and throw some metals in here. I think that's pretty much what we're gonna do this episode. Uh, it's pretty awesome. Uh, if you're wondering how to build one of these smelteries, this is pretty much how. You need a smeltery controller, a seared tank, and it needs to be in the shape of this. And I guess windows are allowed to be all around as long as this first layer is seared brick. But, um, yeah, so the smeltery is pretty pretty complicated, but it's it's fun once you get down to it. Uh, so, I guess let's go, Ed. You got, you wanna go to the, um, you wanna go over to the cave and, you know, kill some guys with me? Come on. Um, oh, we're gonna need some more tools before we go, actually. Remember, we have to make some buckets as well. So let's go over here. I think we have enough iron for sure. There we go. Oh, also I wanna show off an upgrade before we go for a chest, because I have an idea. So, let's get one wooden plank, and I'm going to show you guys how to craft something super cool. Um, and we're also going to need some sticks. There we are. Some sticks. Can't go wrong with some sticks. Alright, let's go in here to our crafting table and craft up a um, or an iron pickaxe, it looks like, we'll need. Yes, an iron pickaxe. Look how cool that looks. If you guys didn't know, the tools uh, do change in this mod pack. It's pretty awesome. They're actually a lot cooler looking. More acceptable. I think I've already talked about it, but I'm talking about it again because it rules. Alright, we're gonna craft um, what's called a BAM and wood to iron chest upgrade, which comes in the iron chest mod, which, um, come to think of it, I should probably review this mod, because it's such a cool mod, and it's in this mod pack, and you guys need to know more about it, 
Um, so basically, I'm just gonna have to right click on a chest and it should upgrade. So I think since it's only one, I don't think it's gonna upgrade two chests. It'll probably separate them, honestly. And I think I'm gonna upgrade the plant chest because this is gonna be the most, no, 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 the block chest. So basically, we're gonna right click, bam. Yeah, and it looks like it only did one. But look how much room we have in just this one chest. If I um, create one more upgrade, which I think I will right now, I think we have enough iron to do, to deal with. Actually, hold on. I'm gonna need another piece of wood. Um, let's try that again. All right, open up and put it around, and throw in a wooden plank, and here we go. Bam. Okay, so I was kind of hoping they'd combine. They might. I figured they should. Let's go ahead and put them next to each other. Maybe that'll work. Um, let's try this. Oh no way. Hmm. That sucks. Um. Oh, well. I mean, it, it shouldn't be that big of a deal. They really should combine. Huh. Oh, well. Let's just use the right one for now so we know all our blocks are pretty much in there. Uh, but as you can see, it's like pretty much uh, it adds, I think, two more two more layers or, or whatever. Something like that. But it's pretty cool. Uh, it's a good mod. You can go all the way up to um, if we type iron chest ooh, at iron chest is that yeah there we go um we can see all the upgrades there's like copper chests there's diamond chests uh, there's crystal chests which is absolutely insane which we will have to get to look at what that's crafted with uh just two pieces of diamond and a gold chest and some glass you know it sounds more complicated than it actually is so we'll have to get around to that because chests rule and no one likes having billions of chests um we just want one good one so, well, it turns out, I guess we have two, so never mind. Uh, we're going to get all this iron we have here, and we're going to craft some buckets. We'll need, like, five buckets worth or something, so. Oh, there we go. I think we can only have, we can only afford three. No, unless there's more. I think I actually, oh my god, creepers. What's going on out here, creepers? Come on, show your face. Stop being a loser. Huh. Yeah, we get random creepers that blow up every now and then around our house because I think those guards, those iron or those knight guards and the archer guards, they fight the creepers. So they 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 suck at fighting, so they end up blowing up the creepers and it really kind of sucks. But uh that's okay. That's okay. At least it's I killed all the guards off near our house, so I, I don't think they'll be exploding near our house, hopefully not too near. Let's craft one more bucket. Let's get 8 for good measures. And just get a whole bunch of lava. Let's do it, you guys. So, we got our pickaxe. We got our sword. We got our guard. We got our bucket. And I... Buckets? I think that's it? Is that it? We don't need sticks anymore, I guess. Tools. Put a tool over here. Yeah, I think that's good. Oh, also, uh, this gem we found last time from Dark Lords RPG is pretty dang good. If you check out the recipe for it, um, or usage for it, you can see that it's used in, like, you know, tools. And the sword does seven attack damage. That's like one more than diamond, so it's pretty dang good. If we get one more, we can craft a pretty good sword. Because I think diamond's six, right? No, no, diamond is seven. Okay, never mind. It's as good as diamond. Um, but that's all it's used for. So I typed in Dark Lords RPG, and this sword came up. It's a blood sword. And look, it does 24 attack damage. It's made with two blood gems and a piece of stone. Not even a stick, a piece of stone. So, we're gonna have to keep our eyes out for some blood gems. Those sound crazy. But, um, now that we built our Tinker's Construct, once we come back, we'll be able to maybe craft a tool or something if we have some time. Isn't that right, guard man? So, follow me. We're gonna go ahead and go across this, this river, not the street, and, um, check out that cave once more. Get some... Get, oh, 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 watch out. There is a... What, what are these guys called? Specials? Special mobs? Oh, nice. Nice drop, actually. An Iron Axe with Fortune 1. That's pretty cool. Cool. So, yeah, it looks a little weird from the bottom, but we'll probably fix it up, make it look a little bit better. I think monsters were actually spawning down here. I think that's where that spider came from, so let's put a torch there. Uh, we'll have to fix that. Um, oh, yeah, and if you're wondering why my Tinker's Construct area looks so stupid, it's because I didn't finish it. So, yeah, maybe if we have some... Oh, there's where that creeper blew up. Dang it. Maybe we, if we have some time, we'll come back and uh, maybe fix it up a little bit or whatever. We'll see what happens. So it looks like we got tons of little ores here. Zinc is cool. It's from the metallurgy. Metallurgy. We're going to say metallurgy. Metallurgy mod. Sounds cool, right? It's hard to say, too. 
Metallurgy. You should say it out loud. It's pretty cool. <laughs> uh, what is this? Uh, we got deep iron ore. What does that mean? We're going to pay attention to the metals now that we know they're really pretty good. Some of them are pretty good. We The Prometheus or whatever we encountered, Promethean uh, ore or whatever it was, was actually a pretty good little ore. It could craft some tools, I think, or some armor. I checked it out. So let's get some of these uh, coal guys and put all these ores up there. There we go. Let's just focus on getting the lava right now. Let's go to the lava, and then we'll get the ores on the way if there's any good ones. Here we go. Prometheum. That was it. Yeah, there's a lot of it, too. We can craft a good chest plate with this. We still have no armor, so we're pretty much barren. We're, we're little bald guys. with uh, Or naked guys. We don't have any armor yet. Uh, where where did I go to get down, exactly? Where Was it over here? I think it was, wasn't it? It's like down in here. No, no, no. I was just over here. Uh, I think it's over over this yonder this way. Uh, yes, it was over here. There we go. This takes us to the center of the earth. Wasn't I in here? That's where I was like mining. That's where my mine shaft was. Let's get this uh this stuff here. Oh, we can't. It requires my uh diamond. Dang. All right. Well, let's go back this way then, and put this stuff up here. Put that down here. Use these as our building blocks. There we go. All right, let's keep going. Maybe we'll find some uh, find some lava. Oh, I remember this place. This is where the trap zombie was. Huh. I just imagined a trap zombie like zombie and then trap music plays. That'd be funny. Trap zombie. <laughs> but uh, let's go ahead and move on. It looks like there's some caves below us because of mobs, I think. We could try it. We could try it. It looks like there's some light being given off. Is this... Oh, whoa. Light exists on the mini-map, too? That's sick. All right, so there's a skeleton over here, which means we should keep mining. We should keep mining down from this direction because we will probably find something cool. We will do just that and try to find some lava because we actually still haven't encountered lava. I thought we did before, but I guess we hadn't. So now we're going to have to dig for it. So, what's up, lava? Come at me, bro. I need ya. Alright, let's keep going. Eh, okay, come on. Come on, I can't see. There we go. Keep on mining. Keep on mining. Uh, when are we gonna find this cave? We need to find the cave. Uh, I have to use my shovel now? This is weird. When am I gonna find something cool? Come on! Minecraft? Alright. Oh, what is this? Hand quite block. I can't even mine it. It's so good. Well then, I guess I'm going to have to come back, won't I? Yes, I will. Let's keep. Oh yes, nice. We found something cool, everybody. All right, let's uh mine up these irons. Oh my God, this is a pretty good little area too. Cool. Nice. We found just what we wanted. What did I just get? Platinum ore. Sounds crazy, guys. We're finding some cool stuff. Um. Let's put these buckets here for now. All right, let's light up this place a little bit. And I'm not talking about with guns. That'd be pretty cool, though. There's no guns in this mod pack. <laughs> there is an Attack of the B team. If you're not watching Attack of the B team, you should. We'll probably get to guns eventually. We haven't yet. All right, so let me mine up this iron. Yes, yes, there we go. And get rid of this water. That was weird. That water was, like, coming out of nowhere. Did you guys see that? Super weird. Um, let's keep going. What what else is down here? Hello. Oh my god. It's a trap skeleton Oh Nice you suck dude. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, okay. I was like what the heck why am I I thought quicksand was down here I was like no way was that his head was that his little head just flying around. <gasps> he dropped some leggings Nice Nice. I like that trap zombie He did make a mess though. Ew, gross. God, he did make a mess. <laughs> hey, he's a hey, little, or not zombie, skeleton. Oh, is, what the heck? Oh, it's like a decoy. Give me those boots and redstone stuff. Yeah, it was like a decoy. That's weird. I hate that. Uh, Median Earth from the Witches and More mod. Sounds crazy. There's some lava. Woo! I don't know why I didn't see that sooner, but we found some, everyone. It looks like just one, though. Eh. Oh, no. Is it still going? Give me more lava! Give me more! Dang it, that was it. I hear a spider, though. Where is that spider? Alright, let's mine up this iron. This my iron looks pretty good. 
Give me that iron. Yes. All right, that sounds great. What is this over here? Je Genesis? Oh, ouch. Ouch, what the heck? What the heck? Oh! Oh, no. All right, I'm going to go back and get my stuff. I'll be right back. Okay, so I made it back. Uh, I destroyed that thingy. Uh, it almost killed me again, but here we are. I, I guess we have a... Oh, what the heck's going on here? I guess we have a gravestone. Probably has all our stuff, doesn't it? Get out of here, zombie. Why would you just spawn like that? Get out of here. Everybody's everybody's hanging out here. What the hell's going on? Stop it. Shut up. Get out of here. <sighs> okay, I'm almost dead again, <laughs> but it's okay. We're going to go ahead and mine up this gravestone, I guess. Is this how this works? Or do I mine the block that it's on? I think I do, right? Mind the block that the gravestone's on. Um, I did die again, actually. <laughs> and that's why there's a second gravestone. But, um, yeah. <laughs> I, I came back, so we're good. God, what a dangerous little mod. I just came into a cave for like a second. I died. Um, twice. Oh, there we go. Give me all that stuff. And I don't think anything's in this one because I didn't die with anything. I had nothing. Let me destroy it. But does this beam thing go away? I hope it does. I don't like it. What's it doing? Go away. Go away, beam. If I destroy this, will you go away? Go away. Yeah, I don't I don't like that very much. Can I remove that? Can I show late take turn the latest deaths off or something? Radar. Um I don't see it anywhere. Mmm. Huh. Maybe it maybe it would be under details and performance. Nah, I don't see it. Never mind. Don't worry about it. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and put my stuff back on and act like nothing happened. I'll fix that latest death thing and I guess another time. Uh, I need to eat some steak. There's some steak. Give me that. I put all my stuff back where they were. Okay, so we're back in business. Let's keep on going like nothing happened. Uh, torches. I need torches. There we go. Uh, hello! What's up, everybody? How's everybody doing? Nice. What's up, Dylan? I didn't know you were here. Oh, looks like we got another trap, everybody. Well, I'm prepared this time. I see your stupid trap. <laughs> oh, God. There's a bunch. There's a bunch. Oh. Wasn't ready for trap. Oh. Okay, so I made it back, destroyed that mob spawner, and got my stuff back. I just turned to keep inventory rule on, you know, just typically. It's a typical thing to do. I don't know why I didn't have it on already. So, we don't have to worry about that anymore. But I think this latest death thing just stays here in general. Just so you know, I guess, where your latest death was. But I found this cool stuff here. I don't know what it is. Um, it's manganese ore. It's pretty crazy sounding. Uh, and then some Genesis cobblestone. Alright, so here's a chest that was below the mob spawner. And it's got some cool stuff in it, if you guys can tell. Looks like it's got some great stuff. Name tag. We can name our guard now. We can name him Sir Ed. Sir Ed sounds great. Um, now where... I don't want this string. Or this. Actually, I don't want that. There we go. Yeah, so we're running low on space here. We don't really have... Oh, nice! Diamond! Yeah! Diamond! Yeah! Diamond feels great! I think this mod uh, pack actually is a mod pack where it doesn't spawn, like, good ores above ground. Like, uh, like in B-Team, how diamonds can be pretty much found on the surface. I think diamonds are actually rare in this one. So I think it's pretty satisfying to probably find some diamonds. Uh, so let's get out of here. Give me some more of this essence ore. Looks great. There we go. Alright, so, um, let's, I hear so many mobs around us, and we actually got enough stuff. And I think I just found some more lava, so I think we're good to go, uh, here pretty soon. What's up, Spidey Man? Oh, gum. Oh, no, 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 no. Where were you when I needed you, Ed? Where were you? Yeah, I just walked home, basically, and, um, Ed was just waiting for me when I walked in the door. You suck, Ed! You're not the coolest, and you should have helped me. Wow, this mod's dangerous. I think this episode we learned that this mod is da this mod pack is dangerous. Like, everything kills you in probably about two hits, especially, like, with no armor. I do have some iron armor on, though, with protection, which is a sad thing. That's, that's, I don't know why I died so fast, but I did, you know? So, that's okay. I had a full inventory. I decided, you know what? I'll just come home. I got one lava bucket. Good enough. So, let's go ahead and take one lava bucket, put it in. Bam. We got the smallest amount of lava, but hey, it'll do. Now, we can go ahead and put all our metals in. If we shift-click, I think it just all goes in. There we go. Look at that, guys. 
Tinker's Construct at work. Um, I wonder how f like fast this lava goes down when being used. Um, I guess we'll find out here in a second. Let's put more stuff. This is great. I love just melting all my metals into Tinker's Construct. If you guys are wondering like what the purpose of this is for, it's that um, essentially you're melting your ores to like into a liquid that you can pour out into blocks, like solid blocks of that ore. So it essentially almost doubles the amount of ingots because um, you'll see once this is melted, it'll say, oh, I have so many ingots worth, which is more than I put in. So I put in 19 iron ores. So um, once this, once these bars get to the top, we'll be able to see, hey, I have more than 19 ores. So we'll see what's up. Um, 38. So instead of 19, I got 38. That is exactly double. So, um, and it looks like the lava runs out, um, pretty fast. Actually, that was a huge chunk of iron, so I don't know. Um, we'll just put everything in there, and, uh, we'll see what the, what the result is next time, I guess. We got lots of cool stuff, guys. We made some awesome progress. Got diamonds. Got our first emerald, it looks like, for whatever reason. Oh, no, we got it in a chest, didn't we? But, yeah, um, this has been a pretty long episode, so <laughs> I guess I'm gonna go ahead and end it off here, and we'll do some other stuff next time. Make sure you guys leave your comments below and suggest some things you'd uh, want to see me do in this mod pack. If maybe maybe you've played a little bit and you know some cool stuff that goes down in this mod pack. Isn't that right, Sir Ed? You know a lot about cool things that happen. Oh, no, you wouldn't because you don't adventure with me. That's right. You pretty much made me die three times. Now, I'm not sure how I feel about you, Ed. Not sure how I feel about you right now, but I'm going to go ahead and close off this episode. So, um, yes, guys, make sure you slap that like button and subscribe to the channel if you want to see some more of this content. Um, I will talk to you stars later, and see you guys.